All right, so I got my microphone set up here. I, I have it plugged into uh, input two, mic line two, on the back of my Digi002 here. Uh, I've got the gain turned up on the front here and everything. And if you look uh, up at the screen, uh, I'm going to go ahead and hit the R here under the track name. That arms the track, so it's ready to record. If I hit that, you can see the meter there uh, as I'm talking. Uh, you can see it jumping up, and I'm going to grab my acoustic guitar here and just play a little bit. That looks like pretty good level. You just want to make sure uh, you're not clipping. Uh, when if you clip, the meter will turn red at the top. Um, but we're we're looking good. So all we got to do now is hit record, and we're going. And of course, uh, I'm doing this uh, listening to the click through the speakers. But of course, you'll want to be using headphones so that the click doesn't bleed into your uh, into your acoustic mic. This is a really sensitive mic, and of course, it's going to pick up the click track that's coming through the. Uh, the speakers, but just to show you guys, I'm going to have uh, the click coming out of the out of the speakers. So we're we're all we're set. We're ready to go. All we have to do now is hit either Apple Spacebar or three on the numeric keypad. Uh, those are just two different ways. As you'll see as you're learning Pro Tools, there's uh, there's four or five different ways to do the same thing, and that's just so people with different uh, mindsets can have a fast workflow inside of Pro Tools. I always just hit three because it's just one key, it's really easy to hit, and it starts your recording. So I'm going to hit that, uh, I'm going to wait for a couple bars of count in, and then I'm going to just record a little eight bar phrase and be finished. Here we go. One, two, three, four. When you're finished, just hit spacebar, and you're done. You've just recorded, if you've been following along, you just recorded your first track inside of Pro Tools. So as you can see, the, uh, uh, it's, it's, it's a really easy, intuitive program to use. In the next set, uh, session, we're going to get into uh, some more specifics about the menus and how to really manipulate the audio in the way that you want, how to import audio and loops into your session. Um, but that should get you going. So. Good luck.